<laughs> My next guest tonight is a contestant on Dancing with the Stars on Mondays and Tuesdays on the great ABC network. <laughs> All right, one of the things I told you there was a lie. <laughs> Take a look at this. Holy crackers. Man, that was great. Isn't we that should, great? We should totally go on that show. Yeah. Hey, yeah, we can do that. We can do that. We, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, it's not a CBS, so sorry. Uh, please welcome the very adorable Catherine Jenkins, everybody. Catherine Jenkins. Great. You Thank look you. absolutely sensational, <laughs> may I say. Thank you very much. Thank you for having me. Here. <laughs> Your dancing looks very nice. That looks very... Aww. Well, you're not really a dancer, are you? I mean, you are, clearly, but you're a singer. I'm trying. I'm you're, trying. I'm, yeah, I'm, a, I'm a classical singer in my day job, but I'm yeah. trying my best at the dancing and just giving it a good, a good go. You, you, you gave it a good go. <laughs> Had you ever danced before? You must have done. I did when I was when I was a child. You know, did some tap classes and things like that. So but did nothing, I. Really? No. <laughs> <laughs> but nothing that's really helping me in this in this situation. But I've got a great partner. I'm dancing with Mark Ballas, and oh, he yeah. is he's been wonderful and really you know just bringing me on the heaps and bounds. So I'm really enjoying it. Where's your accent from? I'm Welsh. Welsh. A fellow I? Celt. Yeah. <laughs> wait, wait, wait! You clearly know nothing about Welsh people. <laughs> They hate it when you clap. <laughs> what is it with the Welsh and singing? Why do they love singing so much in Wales? They sing all the time. People, miners sing, uh, uh, shepherds sing, singers, they do. <laughs> dancers sing. I, I honestly think that it, you, when you grow up in Wales, you know, we have just this huge heritage of song. You know, you sing in church or you sing at the rugby or you sing in the pub. Any excuse to rugby? sing. Do you, yeah. do you play rugby, Catherine? I, I, I watch rugby. Oh, um, yes, I, do. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I sing the anthem sometimes before the, the international game. Games, but um, yeah, I don't think you can grow up in Wales and not be a rugby fan. Do you still live in Wales? No, I live in London now. I've been there for about 14 years because I went off to study at the Royal Academy of Music. Oh, that's nice. Yes. Yeah, yeah, you lived good. in London, didn't you? I did, yeah. I used yeah. to live in Islington. Are you living right. anywhere near there? Um, I used to live in North London. I was Muswell Hill. Area. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah that's nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no. well, you don't live in Muswell Hill now? No, no, I live South London now. South London? Yes. I'm I thought London. everyone in South London smelled a bit like vomit. Didn't you notice that? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a joke. It's not really. No, <laughs> no it is. Do, but you, uh, you were on Doctor Who, which is one of my favourite TV shows. I know, you were I in the Christmas that. special. Oh. Oh. <laughs> are, you a, yes. are you a fan of the show? I'm a huge fan of the show, and, yeah. and it was it was the Christmas special. So you know, it was just a real honour to be asked to do it. And I've never done any acting before. And well, it was, you were great in it. Well, it was one of those things that I wasn't quite sure. And you know, I thought, well. They're not going to trust me with a Christmas episode if I'm going to be rubbish. So I went in and read to them, and then they, they offered me the part. So they, you had to audition for it? No, I, I, I kind of asked if I could go in and read to them, because I didn't want to mess up, you know, such an important <laughs> episode if I was going to be rubbish at it. Look, 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 look. <laughs> This kind of attitude is not going to work in Hollywood at all. <laughs> You can't be helpful and self-effacing. I mean, you can pretend to be, but you can't actually be. That's awful. It's a terrible business. You live here now? Uh, well, I, well, some I've of the time. Over. I've yeah. come over for the show, and, right. you know, because we, we, are, we could possibly be voted off every week. So oh, I'm I don't here. think you're going anywhere for well, a while. Well, you know, I was convinced we were going at the last elimination, so I'm, I'm here for as long as the show requires me, but I'm, I'm having the best time in America. Feeling Do you, very you, enjoy, you enjoy Los oh, Angeles? I'm just having the most amazing time. I, I thought I would enjoy the show anyway, but mm. wasn't surprised for just how much fun it would be, and I just, yeah, I'm having the best time in America. Yeah, it's a very nice place, except for parts of Los Angeles I'm not that keen on. <laughs> <laughs> this this particular area here. Actually. 
Are you uh, are you an outdoors fanatic? Have you been at the beach? Have you been uh, skiing? Uh, I haven't had time to do anything other than train while I've been here. We train. Oh, come on. I really? know. I, wanted to, I haven't even done the tourist things. Like, I wanted to come in and do all those things as well, but that's not happened. No, in L.A., you, me very people, all you see is buses full of disappointed tourists. In LA. <laughs> people get... What happens is they get taken around going, I thought there'd be more to it. <laughs> you know, and it, there's not really that much to see. It's kind of like a oh. big, giant industrial park. Okay. <laughs> well, that's so you're not know. missing anything. Okay, that's good to know. What about New York? You've been to New York? Yes, love that's New York. That's a town, yeah. 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 yeah, I feel like I've, I've been lucky to spend you know, quite a lot of time in America. You should do a road road. trip across America. You Shall mean? I? Yes. I would love to do that you one You should day. do that. What about a singing road trip across America? You and your gay robot skeleton pals. <laughs> That sounds like a great idea. Hi. Are you up for it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, you would also go on the road trip, exactly, too. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Do you know any opera? I can learn. <laughs> You're too thin. No, no. no. <laughs> Male opera singers have got to be big. You've got to be big you know to get what? them. That's, that's a common misconception, actually. You don't need to be big to sing opera. You just need to be, like, fit and healthy. And I think people assume that you have to be kind of, you know, Wait larger than minute. life. Fit and healthy? I've seen some of those Italian singers. I, I, <laughs> I mean, healthy isn't a word that I would use. <laughs> I mean, there's like... <laughs> no, I know, I know uh, you know, a lot are... As you describe. Big. Um, however, it's not it's not necessary. It doesn't right, need to be right, like right. that. Oh, yeah. Well that's good to know. Well clearly, I mean, you know, you oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> awkward silence now. Oh, is that what you want? I was gonna say, how do you want to finish up? Do you want to do an awkward pause or a mouth organ or do you want to Well I was gonna say I don't know how to do an awkward silence, so I feel like I need to do the trivia question. Big cash prize? Yeah, let's do the trivia. Yeah. What time is the shadow statement? It's time for the big cash prize. <laughs> All right, fifty dollars in quarters in uh, in a bag with a dollar sign on it, just like the burglars use. Two ways to win: you can either answer the question, or you can guess what's in my box. Here's how that works. I imagine a box in my head, but I don't know what's in it. Only Jeff knows what's in it. So you have to try and guess what's in it. If you're right, Jeff will tell us. If you're wrong, something awful will happen to you. <laughs> Let's do trivia questions. Oh, trivia question. Yeah. Sounds we like never call it trivia question. Did someone tell you it's called? I've never called it. What do you trivia. call it then? I just call it question. Oh, question. Because it's not trivial at all. It's extremely no. important. You get that. <laughs> not trivial, trivia. Trivia, trivia. question. Yeah. yeah. Trivia. Well, isn't trivia the plural of trivial? <laughs> I don't know. Okay. <laughs> that was actually the question. Yeah. No, no. <laughs> Um, Iceland is in the North Atlantic. Its capital city is Reykjavik. Now, according to studies, within 10, within 10, how many times per day does the average person pass gas? <laughs> wow. Within, within 10. 10. Yeah, I'm not talking opera singers here. I'm talking your average... <laughs> average person. I'm not talking about your... <laughs> I'm talking, you know, within within ten. The average person. Okay, so we have to account for people who would do that a lot. I'm going to go. Good for you. Yes, that's right. <laughs> yeah, because there, there are people who are probably people go who way like, more, like and they would bring this. the average up. Yeah. And then there's people such as yourself who don't at all, Never. which is going to bring the average <laughs> down. I'm going to go with twenty. Oh my God, twenty-four. 